Hi guys, congratulations. You guys have made it through week one, or I guess theoretically, you have made it through week one by the time you're watching this video. I'm pre-recording it, but uh, you have made it through week one unscathed. And so this week we are continuing with our discussion of rhetorical analyses and um, adding to our discussion of rhetorical devices and techniques and picking up with rhetorical appeals. And to help with that, I am asking you guys to read an article in your book called Why Rural America Voted for Trump. And it's not me making some political statement or anything like that. It's just a really good article to practice um, finding rhetorical strategies and rhetorical techniques. So that is what I'm asking you guys to read. Um, I am also going to offer you guys a class activity where we come together um, in an interactive setting and discuss and apply some of these rhetorical strategies, techniques, and appeals um, to the reading that I've assigned for you guys this week. So um, the time is, or the day that I'm going to have you guys um, do that is on Thursday. But the time is to be announced or to be TBA once I have taken a look at the um, survey that I asked you guys to take on Friday. So uh, I will make an announcement as soon as I have everybody's um, or everybody who uh, who attempts to um, answer the survey. I'll have an answer for you guys on on Tuesday. There is, however, a shell already um, developed for that in Canvas for you guys to look at. Um, on the off chance that you are unable to make it to the live interactive discussion, I have an alternative assignment for the people who cannot come to kind of recoup those points. So having said that, uh, that is that's it in terms of what I'm asking you guys to do for this week. We are going to further discuss your rhetorical analysis and on Thursday um, together collectively, I'm going to um, open up a um, an opportunity for you guys to ask questions about that as well. So having said all that, that is our forecast. Please reach out if you have any questions or concerns. And I look forward to Thursday um, in our live optional class discussion.